Hey, welcome to the show. Today in the show, I got a special request to do a three-digit number times another three-digit number. We're going to take 246 times 312. I got that special request from a subscriber. It says right here, um, Car I think it's Carson, K-A-R-S-Y-N. I'm sorry if I mispronounced the name there. It says, um, I'm in third grade. Can you make a video about a three-digit by three-digit multiplication? I'm always looking at the comments. I always love doing requests on here. And also a nice shout out to uh, De Devin Brown. So thank you very much for your comment. And Hada, H-A-D-Y-A. And also um, J-E-M-I-M-A-H said thank you. So uh, thank you very much. Um, we're going to be getting more to the comments after I do the problem at the end of the show there. But uh, I just want to say thank you very much for everybody that does send out a comment. I'm always looking at them. Also, I do have a live show, so make sure you uh, um, check those out once in a while and we will do sp um, live requests. It's a lot of fun. All right, let's go ahead and begin. We're gonna take two times six, then two times four, then two times two. We're gonna work on those numbers. We're kind of going to ignore the three and the one for right now. So let's go ahead and take two times six equals 12. So I go ahead and put the 12 right here, and I put the 1 up there. We're going to add that 1 in a little bit. Not yet, but in a little bit. So now I'm going to go ahead and multiply. 2 times 4 equals 8. Now I'm going to add the 1, which would be 9. So I go ahead and put the 9 right here. And now I'm going to go ahead and multiply. 2 times 2 equals 4. And put the 4 right there. Now I'm going to go ahead and do the whole process over, but now I'm going to just use the 1. I'm going to take 1 times 6, and go ahead and make sure that that 6 is going to be right below the 1 right here. That's the number we're working with. So 1 times 6 equals 6. I put the 6 right here, and then 1 times 4 is 4, and then 1 times 2 equals 2. And it's really important that you make sure that you're writing your numbers very neatly and have them all lined up. If it starts to get moved around, it can change a value. All right, let's go ahead and do the three. We are already done multiplying the one and the two. Now we just need to multiply the three. So again, three times six equals 18. And I put that eight right below the three. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that eight right here. And I carry the one up here. And I'm gonna cross off the old one. And sometimes <laughs> when you start dealing with big numbers like that, it, your, um, your numbers up here can get a little jumbled. So make sure you keep that in order. So I took 3 times 6 equals 18, carry the 1. Now I can take 3 times 4 equals 12, plus the 1, which would be 13. So put the 3 right here and carry the 1. And now I can take 3 times 2 equals 6, plus the 1, which would be 7. So go ahead and put the 7 right here. And now I'm going to add all those numbers. So I put a line right underneath all that. And I'm going to go ahead and just kind of raise this problem up here. It might be kind of difficult to see. So go ahead and make this just a little bit smaller for you there. All right. Now I can go ahead and begin. So now let's go ahead and add these numbers. Two, just bring that two all the way down here. And then nine plus six equals 15. So I put the five right here and I carry the one right up there. Make that one just a little bit bigger. And then I'll take, um, sometimes when you add a lot of numbers, sometimes it's you know, you can try to do some different strategies on which one to add first. So I'm going to take 4 plus 4 equals 8, and then 8 plus 8 equals 16, plus the 1, which would be 17. We'll put the 7 right here, and then carry the 1, and then 2 plus 1 equals 3, and then 3 plus 3 equals 6. And then I have the 7, and just bring the 7 down right there. So that would be our answer, 76,752. Hey, thanks a lot for watching the show. Right now I'm going to go over some of the uh, comments that I have from my viewers here. So let's go back to the first page. On the first page, um, we have Y-O-S-E-I-F said, thank you very much for helping me at the math test. So I really appreciate your comment there. We also have LJ Family. Um, I, I believe uh, she's saying, Luke, it says, hi. So uh, my son Lucas is on the uh, live shows. And we have a lot of fun. Sometimes we'll be doing map games. And then uh, PEMA says, you saved me for, from my exam. So thank you. I'm always, I'm, it just means so much that I can be able to help 
some of you out there. And let's go to another comment here uh, and uh, on this page. Um, I have um, this person right here. It's at uh, under slash J-O-J under slash X. And I want to thank you so much for your comment. I read it and it meant a lot to me that I'm able to help you. And I don't want you to worry about the future. All right. Um, I just we're just going to take it day by day. And, you know, everything that you wrote to me in there, I, I just have the feeling that throughout through all your experiences, you've gone through some, you know, good experiences and, and tough experiences, just like all of us. And sometimes even with math, you know, it's, it can get a little um, hard for you. But when you when you when it's hard for you and then you figure it out, you got to remember that a lot of other people are going through that. And you might consider someday teaching because um, you're able to touch other people's lives. Now, all of us, um, we will be a teacher, maybe to our own kids or to our friends. And um, it's just a very rewarding um, occupation. And, and just um, I just really appreciated your comment. And I know for a fact um, that you're going to do great in your future. Uh, I'll be praying for you and thinking about you, uh, just like I do with all of you out there. So thank you very much. I really appreciated that. So um, I really appreciate that. Also, we have at, and then it's G-A-D East 5141. And you are from uh, Jamaica. Oh, I bet it's I bet it's a lot warmer from where I am right now. So I would love to visit there. I wonder, uh, have you ever been to the beaches? Um, I, I love going to the beach and to the ocean and going snorkeling and swimming. It's one of my favorite hobbies. I have a, a show called The Outdoor Channel. Um, if you look down there, you'll find that show. I sure appreciate it if you go there and hit that, um, that subscribe button to that. But I have some videos on there where we go snorkeling. I really enjoy snorkeling. So check that out. It's a, an outdoor show. It's, it's t if you look way down there in my description, you'll find a link to that. And then um, we also, uh, he also said from um, Jamaica, also at, at K-A-H-F-P-A-T-E, and then um, 2394, uh, says from India. I have a lot of people from India, Philippines, um, you know, just all around the world. And I'm just, it just amazes me how I can um, help people, and they help me um, every single day. I love reading the comments. So, hey, thank you very much for joining our show. I hope you have a great day out there. Be safe and uh, make sure you get some exercise. We'll talk to you later. Adios. Goodbye.